So here we have the Volkswagen Golf on a 70 plate. I'll start off by showing you inside the boot and then we can hop in and run through some controls from there. As we approach the boot, you can see we have reversing sensors, plenty of boot space as well, along with that 60-40 split folding rear seat should you wish to increase this space even further. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. On the left-hand side, we have the rev counter and on the right-hand side, the speedometer. Uh, just beneath that speedometer section, you can see the total miles for the car, which are 2,927. You can change the information displayed here, here and here by using buttons on the steering wheel. So over on the left, for example, you have a choice of the things that you can see me scrolling through now. Over on the right, similar kind of story. Uh, you can change to the information there and also in the center as well. The buttons that I was using to do that are here. We have phone and stereo controls over that side as well. Stereo controls continue on the left along with uh, cruise control. Once you set cruise control on, hit this button. Uh, this car is able to maintain its own distance between itself and the car in front. It will both speed up and slow down according to the car in front's speed. Uh, we've done a video showing how that works on our website and on our YouTube channel. Over in the center, we have the touch screen for the car. So uh, we're on the home screen at the moment. There are a choice of home screens. You'll see uh, this car's got satellite navigation. There's a full video showing how that works, again, on our website and YouTube channel. When it comes to music, we have FM, DAB, and internet radio. Uh, or you can listen to your own music, of course. Uh, one of the ways in which you can do that is by streaming it, streaming it wirelessly via Bluetooth audio. Once you paired your phone, of course, which is done just here. You can also adjust the driver temperature and passenger temperature from up here. Um, or you can make proper adjustments by hitting this button. That will open up your climate control menu and you can adjust fan speed, temperature, uh, the direction of the air, etc. from there. Uh, down here, you've also got assist systems and your parking camera. Uh, putting the vehicle in reverse will automatically open the parking camera or press the button I just pressed. Beneath that, we have two USB-C inputs and wireless charging for your phone. We have the start and stop button for the engine, a six-speed manual gearbox, and then electronic handbrake with auto hold function. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car in person and have a test drive, please feel free to call any of our MJA sites. We'd love to hear from you soon.